All right, folks, welcome back to the Daily Channel. Today we are going thrifting, always looking for stuff that we could use ourselves or sell online, but never know what you're gonna find though, so let's go find let's it. Let's go find it. Getting things started off here at this super fancy Goodwill. Well, the one that we're going after is fancier. Is fancier. These are the fanciest Goodwills <laughs> in all of Orlando. There you go. But uh, yeah, never know what you're gonna find, so let's go find it. <sighs> the Doesn't feel complete if there's not yeah, two. Yeah, if there's not two. The <laughs> intros. Somehow, you guys are, uh, <laughs> I think we gained almost. Uh, 1400 subscribers last week and I have no idea you guys just love being tortured daily So if you want to be tortured daily hit that subscribe button Let's see if we can find it at the Goodwill today. Well dang this isn't something that you see at Goodwill every single day You got some uh, golf clubs behind the valuables uh, counter. We got some Wii games over there high school musical sing-along But there's a uh, multi-compound grip. Let's see if we can see what it is from uh, this side uh, Can't really tell I think Oh, it's a uh, 1999. There's a set of irons in there for 79.99. Look like uh, I get the Memphis uh, shafts in there, so those are old Callaways. But can't tell what driver that is. We'll have to uh, ask. Also, got some uh, arrows over there. And I think that's a used NASCAR tire. We used to find those all the time in Daytona. And there was this one uh, thrift store that had like 20 of them. They're 25 dollars a piece, and they never sold any of them. I would think if you're like a NASCAR fan, it'd be kind of a cool piece to uh, have. Interesting. But what do I know? Well, we got King Kong up there. Sweet. Well, if they have uh, golf clubs behind the uh, valuables counter, I doubt they're going to have any uh, in the actual golf club section. We can't play adventure. Oh, yeah. That's pretty cool. The Princess Bride. You killed my father. <laughs> now I shall go buy that. golf clubs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that, but I know where we're headed. Golf clubs. Oh, man. Well, what do I know? I assume since they had so many clubs up in the front that they were going to have any back here, but this is... Overflow. The, yeah, <laughs> overflow. We got some uh, wind dry tech uh, grips that have uh, met a uh, Florida garage in the summer. That's kind of funny. The uh, grips cost more than those uh, clubs basically a Wilson uh, starter set. We got a uh, Faldo Series Adams. We got a uh, Tommy Armour Evo wedge. Got a Callaway bag that Ashley has uh, seemed to be fond of. Yeah. That one's uh, pretty cool. Looks like it's been uh, faded out a little bit too much in the uh, sun. Florida sun. Yep. Florida sun. Yeah. Wing grips and golf bags. Yep. Oh, old heron. Oh, old head. I huh. thought it was old heron. I played that course, but uh, not old head. What do we got over here? A Baffler Steel Classic, a shallow driver. Interesting marketing on that one. Got another one right here, Dual Track Greyhawk. Oh. <laughs> Pretty interesting. Oh, there's an orange whip. Huh. Never seen one of these at uh, Goodwill before. Oh. The clubs in here are usually like $3.99, so we'll definitely uh, be picking that up. That, those things go for like 90 bucks on uh, eBay still. Yeah, we got a bunch of uh, full iron sets back here. It's kind of crazy. I have no idea what those are. <laughs> Let's see what these ones are. Uh, Thunderbird. I've never literally golf clubs. Oh, we got some Payne Stewart NFL autographs. I've seen these before. Super cool. Payne Stewart, legendary golfer, passed uh, uh, way too early to yeah. uh, say the least. Very tragic. But uh, we got some, uh, I think those are snake eye. Yeah, full set of uh, snake eyes irons. I think it's one Hogan radio sandwich. Uh, oh, yeah, it's, it's a it's sure out. The... Yeah, I think it's with the uh, Payne Stewart's. Yeah. What else we got over here? Oh, we got a Wilson Harmonized Wedge. Be the 1,000th time that I've <laughs> reminded you guys that we did a, a review on that wedge on the uh, main channel with my dad. That was a lot of fun. Cheapest oh. wedge on Amazon. We got, oh, you got, still got that Nike Sumo Junior Club. Yeah. That thing has been in here forever. We might as well pick that up. It's been in here for like months. We always give away the uh, Junior Clubs when we sell at the flea market. Now so. it's just because it's impossible to get out. Yeah, $3.99. <laughs> be uh, giving stuff away at the flea market when we set up and sell there. Got another one to uh, give away. Mm. And an orange whip. Sweet. Well, what do I know? I, th I literally thought there were going to be any golf clubs right. <laughs> because they, uh, they had them in the uh, front. But, oh, they got the pink at driver, too. But uh, we'll uh, see what else they got in the uh, Goodwill. Mm -hmm. Got an Ashley-sized chair over there. <laughs> oh, man, Ashley just pulled out an absolute grail. We'll start with these things uh, first, though. Got a uh, Mets t-shirt jersey to match mine. Ashley's got a uh, Daniel Murphy one now. And then we also have this uh, Alex Morgan t-shirt jersey. Super cool. And uh, this thing is awesome. <laughs> a uh, Wyoming University shirt. That is super cool wyoming is one of our uh, favorite states <laughs> what we remember of it we almost passed out via uh, <laughs> the altitude, altitude sickness but it was like super be. beautiful remember that uh, walmart there was only like one store in the entire county it was a walmart and the sheriff's office was in it yeah i don't know why that was fascinating to me though. yeah but also we got some uh, under armor golf shoes in ashley size only 6.99 i think these are the speeds yeah that's the speed logo right there i think i don't know they could be the speeds we'll call them the speeds but check this out absolute grail this is like one of the only days where you're not wearing <laughs> yours but uh check Maybe this out your size yeah my size mission tortilla hat that is if you guys have watched the this channel or the uh, other channel yeah. ashley's always wearing a, a mission tortilla hat always in a, on a mission always on a mission 
for mission tortilla hats. If you look these things up on eBay, it's hilarious. The it's like Nike ones, to find. yeah, the Nike ones go for over a hundred dollars. I don't know how much this one's going for. It doesn't matter because I'm going to. I keep it. Yeah. Brand new with tags. Got a little bit of wear right there. We can definitely yeah, uh, clean I think that it's up. Spot treated. Yeah, spot treated okay. for sure. Man, that's <laughs> sick. Nice find. Thank you. All right, a successful stop at the first Goodwill. Also, they had a, a successful stop. He's got a, a recliner in the back of the uh, truck, but Good to go. <laughs> let's see if this uh, even fancier Goodwill has even fancier deals for us. Sweet. Sweet. That was a really good transition for me. It was. So it's about average for anybody else. <laughs> well, Ashley has found a couple of things to add to her uh, jersey collection. We'll show you those here in a second. But this hat section is amazing. We got JB's Fish Camp, one of our favorite uh, seafood restaurants in uh, Volusia County. And we also have a lifetime supply of uh, Clemson uh, hats. Oh, that was a nice Vanna White little uh, display <laughs> right there, man. I think there's like 20 of the uh, orange ones and then uh, 20 of the gray ones. You can probably sell these for like $20 a uh, piece on uh, eBay. And there's just like one listing, yeah. just like change the quantity. One and done. One and done. Those are pretty uh, sweet. I might actually pick up an uh, orange one. That one's sick. Mm -hmm. But uh, almost as sick as these uh, jerseys. This one is, right. yeah, that is one of the cooler jerseys we've ever found. A uh, Mo Bamba Youth, I forget, I think it's like a, a special edition uh, jersey yeah. too. Got the uh, Disney insignia on there. That is uh, pretty sweet. And also this is the, I can't tell if this is bootleg or just because it's so small, I'm not used to the dimensions. I really a uh, Troy Palomalu, that is. Steelers jersey? Yeah. It's cool looking. It's, it's, almost, it's almost like it's on the edge where it's almost cool. It's, it's bootleg. so bootleg that it, yeah, yeah I don't know, but like it is like kind of high quality stitching at the same time. I'm not really sure what's going on, on there, but uh, lifetime supply of uh, Clemson hats and a uh, Mo Bamba jersey that we're definitely going to pick up. How much are the jerseys here? Only $7.99. For the youth. Yeah, that's pretty sweet though. Mm -hmm. But uh, let's go check out the golf clubs. Nice. <laughs> I wonder how many people commented that there was a President's Cup hat. Right in front of your face, <laughs> Just uh, sitting there, yeah. But I uh, <laughs> realized that after a while, we got some golf clubs over here. Spalding, laminate, those are kind of uh, cool though. Got a uh, Lynx, oh man, check out this old school Nike oh golf God. bag. That the last time we were here, we found that a uh, uh, tailor-made uh, staff bag, and it was in here forever. No one picked it up. I will bet you a thousand dollars, though. Not we're not actually gonna bet a thousand dollars, but that the uh, stand doesn't that's work. The old part. school Nike bags are so cool and collectible, Let's especially with the uh, old work. logo. Uh, but the stands never work. Let's see if it works. Oh, what? that is the rarest thing in the history of mankind. That was like an oddly sensational feeling because yeah. I was expecting it to not work. That is definitely going to. I picked that up. You guys know that we love the Nike golf stuff, and those are awesome. I can't believe that. I, well, there's another Nike bag right there. Just saying, I missed the uh, President's Cup, and I was talking about it. I found a, another Nike bag. That one is at uh, 19.99. It's got the uh, dividers though, missing the strap, but that is pretty dang cool. But I like the uh, old school Nike that golf cool logo. That yeah, that is sick. Well. There you go. Sweet. Sweet. Check out this valuables case. It is absolutely loaded. We got a couple of Wii's, a couple of Xbox 360's. We got this uh, Louis Vuitton looking <laughs> Detroit Tigers hat that they have for $1,600. That might be the most expensive thing I've ever seen in a uh, Goodwill. That's but a also one. check this out. There's like a, a Vera Bradley, what do you call that? Like a uh, cosmetic bag. Cosmetic bag that is going for over $90. I think that's a new price, but that's still, that's yeah. a very expensive. Very cosmetic. expensive. <laughs> And then also we got a, a Castaway Club, the uh, Disney Cruise Line thing. And I think this is also a Disney Cruise Line uh, bag yeah, down there as well. But comment below, is this the most expensive thing That's that you have? Expensive. I wonder if it's like actually real. Is it like a Louis Vuitton one? I don't there's know. no way I'm gambling $1,600. I gambled a, a thousand on that jokingly, but there's no way I'm gambling a $1,600 on a Goodwill hat. Oh. But this is the most loaded Goodwill uh, valuables case I've oh, ever yeah. seen. Let's see what it is. Oh. Results did not. Is there suggestions? It suggests nothing. It we'll suggested nothing. Oh, get this live. Oh, there we go. Whoa! Scumbag. The scumbag hat. What in the world? Comment below if you have ever have have ever have, have ever seen one of these things before. Easy also, for me to I'll say. I'll take the one that kind of looks like it for fifteen dollars. That's crazy. <laughs> Sixteen hundred dollar hat in Goodwill. That's a new one. Huh. That is uh, bizarre. <laughs> I have no words on that one. I, neither do I. Check this out right here. A Mickey and Minnie walk in the park statue over there. I have no idea how much it is. We're definitely going to ask $225. The valuable section. Also, we passed on the $1,600 hat. We probably goes without that saying, but uh, the valuable section in here is pretty intense. All right, we ended up passing up on the Mini and Mickey because it was going for $200, but we're not gonna pass up on this uh, opportunity right here. We are driving home and Disney Springs is, where'd you go? Oh, you. oh, that's blasphemy. You can't cover up Tebow. That was cool. 
Oh, oh man, that is uh, the worst. That's a crime against humanity oh, right there. But uh, <laughs> almost a cri as big of a crime against humanity as $1,600 for a hat. But we figured out why. Apparently, it's like a limited edition thing. It's yeah. the, uh, there's like a famous meme. Yeah, we'll put up a picture. Yeah, we'll put up a picture. I'm sure you've seen it. <laughs> yeah, but it was uh, kind of uh, funny to see a $1,600 hat at uh, Goodwill. But like I was saying, we're not passing up the opportunity. Disney Springs is finally not busy with all the holidays. So we're going to grab some uh, dinner. But that was <laughs> that good one that good one was very interesting to us say the least you know it is not busy with these two benches right here overlooking the disney springs balloon are empty also there's one of the amphibious uh, cars yeah, cool. this place is empty but what's not going to be empty is our stomach after this from everglaze a donut breakfast burger it's basically a glazed donut with a fried egg cheese and mayonnaise i I'm only gonna have one bite of this. I'm, I guarantee I'm kind you. Of scared. Yeah, I'm kind of uh, scared of this. What's scarier, the Goodwill prices lately or this? That is. That's tough. That's tough. But you want to go in uh, first? I don't even know how you go in. Oh, uh, this is gonna be a belly bomb. This is like a uh, the old school uh, White Castle. Oh, there we go. Stomach pains after this one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at that. All right. Wish Thumbnail right luck. there. <laughs> Oh, no, this is gonna, gonna be painful. Also, we uh, walked by Pepe. Update, there were people dining in there. I that know. is also our now most popular video on this channel. <laughs> we filmed it in 30 minutes, and I was like, ah, we're not gonna post this. And it's got over 100,000 views. So it's kind of crazy. You. Thank you guys for that. But uh, also, how was the uh, breakfast burger? It's very sweet, but it is actually much better than you expect. Just and like I also you. Have well, you're better. Lots of no. napkins in my uh, pocket because I figured this is going to need it. Yeah, I just gave you a weird compliment. <laughs> Luckily, you didn't hear it. <laughs> Everybody else did. But uh, yeah, I'm going to. I think we need a, a pause. Well, it stands up. Also, you know, we're in Disney when you're eating on trash cans. Yeah, also, we need a pause because I'm not going to touch the phone <laughs> like this. Cut. Man, that thing is a monstrosity. Yeah, it kind of fell apart a little bit. Oh, but, that's my bad. Uh, it no. was so hard to pick up the first time. I thought I was helping. Well, we will reconstruct. This is not a deconstructed uh, <laughs> no. burger right here. This is, I'm only having one bite and I'm going to eat salad for the rest of my life after this one. It works much better than you think it would. And the actual burger itself is very good. They have a non- um, Yeah, it's a dollar extra to get it yeah, donut. Yeah, non-glazed donut option. I think I would do that next time. But it, for amusement, it was worth That is fantastic. <laughs> Hopefully you guys did find this uh, video fantastic. This is fantastic. Yeah. Daily video number something. If you want to be uh, tortured daily with our videos, make sure you subscribe so you never miss another one. No, you have to hit this. You have to hit the bell. Dang. Yeah. I'm I really almost sounded like this. a YouTuber. <laughs> right? I don't know. Somehow you tried. people like watching us. Uh, we know. tried. Hopefully you enjoyed our try. Yeah. But comment below if that's the uh, most expensive thing you've ever seen at a Goodwill. A $1,600 hat. Yeah. Without a doubt for us, that was crazy. That is uh, pretty, uh, pretty out there. But uh, hope you guys did like this video. I said I was gonna have one bite, but I'm having two. <laughs> it's like lace; you can't just have one bite. Right? Oh, there you didn't, you didn't get much of the donut. It's fine. Mm, mm. Yeah, the actual burger is really good. Very good. Hope you guys thought this uh, video is very good, and we'll see you next time. Bye guys. Bye. That's so good. <laughs> Take it away from me. Take it away from me. Take it away. Also, give me napkins. Put it in your purse. Bye. Bye.